Hi, this is Nancy at Notions. We had a really exciting visit with one of our vendors today. Now, this is a new vendor. This is Marabou. Marabou's been around for 150 years. Everything is made in Germany, but they've only been here in the United States for a little over a year. So this is really exciting that we get to show you some of their work. This is Celia. She's the national educator. She's been doing demos. I just want to say for a while. She's very experienced at this. I don't want you, I don't want to give any numbers or anything. So no, she's going to take us through just a few of the products that they have, some instant demos, and then we'll close out and tell you where you can find out more. Okay? All right. So okay. go ahead. Right. Hi there. Okay, well I'm going to start and uh, show the um, shimmer liners, fashion liners, and the shimmer paints, which are available through Notions. And uh, you're going to see this upside down, but we'll uh, try here. So this has got a really nice fine nib on it. You just start the, uh, it's in a 25 ml squeeze bottle. I'm just going to take this here and you can see how beautiful it flows out. It really does. So you can get some really nice designs. You could, if you wanted to, uh, take a paper design and place it underneath the, the shirt or the fabric, and you could copy it if you wanted to do that and do some uh, sort of zen tangle on fabric. Uh, these can also be shaded. So I'm just going to take a brush here and give some dimension there to the, the pair. I can do that, just give you an idea so that you can work with it. Now it's still wet. And then I'm going to go straight into the paint. So these are um, both the shimmer paint and the liners. So there's nine standard liners, which are matte, and there's nine shimmer liners, uh, which are the, the sort of sparkly ones. And then we have 11 shimmer colors in the fashion spray. This is all German made product, and this is a German cosmetic grade pump. Okay, so it's an extremely fine pump. I'm gonna take and use one of our stencils. Um, all, the, all of our stencils are um, silhouettes, and I just placed this on. I put a little bit of low tack adhesive on there. You can see I've collected some paint on top of mine. And I'm just gonna take this. Now you want to actually shake these. I might want to pass you to shake them. Yeah, I can first. You can, can shake, shake yeah. I so you wanna get make sure that the um, Mica is thoroughly mixed in the bottle. You can hear there's a little marble floating around in there. Um, it's important to do that, otherwise the mica gets caught in the uh, little pipe. And just prime the pump, and we'll go on here. These will work on dark fabrics, as you saw um, before. Uh, they worked, as you can see, you get really nice fine mist. This works also on paper, should you want to work with it on paper. Uh, they work on natural fibres or fibres up to 20% man-made. And uh, there you go, you've got some of this. Now if I can just take my light, and hopefully you'll be able to see that. You can see how these and so they're not it's even got dry. Beautiful shimmer. It's going to be permanent on the fabrics after just how long? You did you say? You just uh, just leave it to dry and then iron it um, with a hot dry iron with uh, image side up with a piece of paper between the iron and um, the fabric, or you can place it in the oven at 300 degrees for eight minutes. We thought that was funny when she talked about putting it in the oven for 300 degrees, and I'm thinking, and why would I put a shirt in the oven? No, it's for if you're actually painting your shoes. It's so popular paint your convert, converse that's tennis good. shoes kind of things. So that's why you would put it in the oven. So love this idea. We're going to show you one more couple of other demo videos yep. here. And I'll just put some um, shimmer liner on here. Uh, you can see this. My liner smudged just there. But this is not a puff liner. I don't know if you can see real close in there. But you can see how it almost looks like it's foiled. It's very flush, very classy, and um, dries completely flat. That's all um, 18 colors off. And this is on silk? So this is actually on silk, yeah. So natural fiber or up to 20% man-made is how to use those, okay. We're back with Marabou. Now we've gone from the fabric shimmers and now we're gonna start talking about the art crayons. Yeah. All right, Celia. Okay, great. Um, Art Crayon is an extremely smooth, buttery crayon. Comes in a lipstick style applicator. Uh, I'll just show you here. And this is the amount of product that you're going to get into 
the, uh, the container. So you can see you've got a lot of product there. These are really, really buttery smooth. What I'm going to do is I'm going to show you on two different surfaces. Um, I'm going to show you on paper and then on canvas and I have them in black and on white canvas. So these are extremely soft. It's almost like a lipstick. So this can work similarly to like an oil pastel. Um, so it's creamy or it can work like a watercolor depending on how you wish to use that. I'll just take some water and spray this uh, piece of watercolor paper here. Let's make it wet, so we'll do wet into wet. And I'll take this, as you can see, these are really, really highly pigmented. So lots of color in there. And it dissolves all the way down, it really is beautiful. So I'm just gonna dry my hand off and then I'm gonna use my hand to blend these are extremely light fast as well so they're very um, permanent and as you can see how this and there's no water on my glove uh, it's just the glove here you could use your fingers if you want uh, without a glove there's nothing toxic in here and I'll do that and then I want to show you also on dark just to show you the coverage that you can actually get on dark surfaces as well. And again, you can see how smooth and creamy that actually is. Okay, so I'll leave that there. I just want to show you a very brief, uh, simple subtraction technique. This is working on the canvas again. I'm just going to take one of my stencils and I'm going to take a baby wipe and Squeeze some of the extra water out of that baby wipe. I want it to be too damp. And then I'm just going to take this and remove off the colour. As you can see, these after 24 hours are wipe proof. And uh, so you can do them on walls, you want to protect it with a spray varnish or a paintable varnish if it's an area where you get high traffic. Um, but they're great for all different types of surfaces and they'll work on paper, um, on grounds, on different acrylics. Um, a lot of fun to work with. And there you go. You've got this uh, real quick, just show you a little piece on, you can do the same thing on the dark. To do that, and I'm going to use these in con combination with another product that we have. There you go, simple, very, very cool. easy. Yep, very cool. Okay. So, you see, with the art crayons, simple techniques, there's no reason that you couldn't be doing this in your store. Little demo like this at the store counter, and you've sold a lot of art crayons. They're so versatile, there's so many different things you can do with it. You can treat it like a watercolor paint, you can treat it like a crayon. In terms of card making and mixed media, the options are truly endless. Okay, right, so, now so now I'm going to talk about the Art Spray. The Art Spray is an acrylic. This is really a wonderful product. Um, the, my hippo is over there. I was going to show that and the leather, uh, if you can find it. So this goes on to, this is an acrylic spray. It's really, really low viscosity. So I'm just going to pop my stencil back down again and I'll spray uh, straight onto here. This is a German cosmetic grey pump. This has a little ball bearing in it, similar to the shimmer colours. You want to get that mixed up. Um, and you can see how evenly these will spray. Prime the pump. And then just move that around. And we'll take some of this other colour. This is petrol. And we'll just mist it. And you can see how easy that is to use. You can also um, use this like a watercolor. So this was actually the art spray sprayed onto a three-dimensional object uh, that was coated with our mousse. Uh, here it is on leather. Um, and you've seen the um, submarine at the beginning. So you can use it like a watercolor if you want to. You can paint with it. And you can also take, if you want to use some alcohol, you can drip alcohol and get these wonderful effects 
really easily. Now what's also cool is it works extremely well over the um, art crayon. You don't even need to wait until it's dry. We'll pop that on there like that. And I'll just take this and mist it. And that'll give us a really nice pattern. And if you want to do it again and do something <laughs> even completely different, so you just can constantly wowing your now customers. Something completely new. <laughs> yeah. So we just take this and what we're going to do is just take a little bit of the colour off here so we had an overspray so you end up with something that looks quite complex but was very easy to create. As you can see, I'm just doing this the third time and third you've got it. Charm. All right, that's fabulous. Okay. So we've got the crayons, we did the spray. The stencils are all available also. So this one was the little mixed media. I love, love, love that that art spray is gonna be permanent on leather. I have a thousand different ideas in my head right now what I'm gonna do with that. We have one more demo coming up. This demo Celia is gonna do is easy marbling. You are gonna be just blown away by the quality and the interest of the product that you make or the, the project that you do using this marbling technique. This is gonna be the quickest demo you will ever do in your store and you will be able to sell tons of products, super easy. All right, go to town. Hi. Okay, so the easy marble is, comes in 15 ml bottles. It's a resin, it's a, sol a solvent-based resin with light fast dye in there. So it sticks to all these really cool kind of products that you'll see like styrofoam, paper, glass. You can marble candles with this. So come the holidays, this is an awesome uh, product to use. So what I'm gonna do here, I'm just gonna put these away so we get some space. And I'll show you three-dimensional uh, marbling first. So I'll just make sure that I've got the right products here. It's easy marble, okay. So, it's got a little, how do you can see that? It's actually just a little opening on the top of the jar there. So, what you do is you put your drops in. I'm gonna put anywhere around between five and 10 drops of the first color. And then if I was to use the colors in the set, you get red, blue, yellow, green, black and white, which are opaque. The other colors are transparent. So we'll pop some of these in here. Pop a little bit of red. And you really, all you need to do, you can use a cocktail stick or something similar, and you can just swirl this around, get your marbling pattern that you want. And then you take your styrofoam, compressed styrofoam ball. Which and this is the aha moment here. Okay, so you want to go slowly into this and this just requires water no other chemicals nothing else Ooh, now look at that that is so cool <laughs> and that sticks onto a three-dimensional surface and what you can do because you've still got some left we can go and do another one while we're at it so we can make two for the price of one all right put those in that little pretty container now no. we have a bouquet of marbled little styrofoam balls how and pretty is that you just clean the water off to do to start the demo and start again and then you can okay. get it so this super simple demo you know that that's going to wow everybody that sees it all right this next one you're going to use in all of your different paper and flat type um things so yeah, is you this... can use you can use on wood you can use on here we have a little marabou m done with wood and uh basically you can use on plastic e eggs you can use this there's not really a surface i've found that it doesn't work on okay uh, just got to make sure it's not treated with anything okay. um that might repel it so let's take um well we'll take this so you basically um, you, you, you want to work quite quickly with this the first color like i said you want to get some uh, a good nice covering of marble color there. There's 22 open stock colors. As I said, there's six in the set and there's 22 in the open stock, which also include clear, plus a bunch of really cool colors like this Reseda, which is an opaque color. And that's just a great green. I mean, look at that green and red. Can't go much better than that. We'll do a little yellow in there. I love how that one's the, the clear kind, so you can see through that. Yep, that's a transparent Transparent, one. that's the word. <laughs> yeah, technology. Te technical word. Uh -huh. So then again, you're just going to do the same, uh, whatever marbling uh, pattern you want to make. We'll do this. And then I'm just going to take, it's a postcard. So 
watercolour postcard, place it down in there, and then before you take it out, just take a piece of paper and run along the edge of the card just to break the marbling colour away because this is a, a solvent based resin and bingo. There you go, ta da! Okay. Beautiful colours, you're going to get so many cool techniques using this marbling. So we've done the crayons, we've done the, the shimmer on the fabric, we've done the art spray, we've done the marbling. There also is available paints for porcelain and glass. There's a whole nother line that you'll find on the Notions website for that. And a, um, a mousse, a, a, a mousse. mixed media mousse that's going to be a it's colored really mousse that's, cool. yeah, like a modeling mousse. So we have covered a lot of product. In a very it's, short period in of time. In a very short period of time, you're an exceptional demo work. Oh, well, thank you. Really good job. It's a good thing you're making your living doing this. Great job. <laughs> yeah. So check out all of these on the Notions Marketing website. It's Marabu, M-A-R-A-B-U. And there are also going to be some um, media clips that you'll be able to watch Celia doing some of these demos right there on the website. If you have any questions, contact your sales rep.